Jack, uh, were you expecting that? Um, no, I got told to box. Um, first three rounds, used my jab, but then I um, I got caught. Well, I did got caught. I got hit first round, and then after that, I think uh, my head went a little bit in the fight to get involved in a fight. And it didn't last long. Was it the second round you stopped him then? Yeah, second round. Some of those body shots you were sinking in on him, mate, were, were vicious. Yeah, good. Tommy. Well, I it? knew as soon as he got hit with that. I've never seen him hit like that. Uh, I, oh, I've seen him get hit plenty of times, and he's been in sparring with some big punches, but I've never seen him like. I won't know if it was wobble, but his eyes went a little bit to sleep then, and I thought, <laughs> fucking hell, you know what I mean? But. Well, it was some unit though, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. He looked more like a, a bodybuilder than a boxer. I mean, he had some muscles there. I think his, his spit had muscles. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I was. Uh, I, I thought mm, could be a, 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 a tough night for you, but well, it were, but it were condensed into two rounds. <laughs> um, and he, but the plan were to box for three, have a look at him. If it was still not, if he still weren't ready for the second, go up for six, and then have a look at him again. And but he just. I don't know. I'm gonna have to do some serious hard work with him. Well, <laughs> you know something that that guy's a strange record. I think his record coming into fight was four wins with uh, uh, twelve losses. But he had a, a two part career. Yeah. He had a, he started in 2011, boxed for about three two two three years, had a few fights, lost most of them, came back uh, last year, and since he come back, he, he's had a 50 50 record and been in with some good kids and, and beat some good kids he as well. Heavier, fitter, and better. Mm. Yeah, and, and looking like he's he, you know. He, he stopped. He stopped a couple, hadn't he? Yeah. The, the, he, the four wins. He stopped two of them. Yeah. He, um, so we knew he could punch a bit, and we'd done some work on evading his right hand. But like I said, uh, a, a scrap to Jack is like red rag to a bull, and he <laughs> he, he just wants it. And that and that when I keep saying um, we've only seen twenty five percent of him, that's the twenty five percent that I know. So all them in from amateur day and all it, that's the. And, I'm trying to fucking get in box and I don't want any of that again, you know, that picky right hand, so... Well, I, I was fortunate to watch you spar with uh, Mark Thompson, it was nice, you were using your jab and, and keeping Mark at long range and I thought that was going to be, uh, you know, worked on tonight, but obviously it didn't because he caught you early and you, you went into fight mode and it didn't seem to be such a bad mode though, does it? You did do it pretty well. I enjoy it, but he don't. Well, but, but it is with Jack. Fighting's easy because he doesn't have to think about it. He just does it. And boxing's hard. So it's the thinking part that fucking causes Jack grief. But considering what's happened this week with his dad and that, it's been an excellent well, night. Really. Can I just mention that? I mean, you were thinking of pulling out, wasn't you? Because your dad's just well, been took poorly, hasn't he? Yeah, he's been ill. Um, I don't really want to go into it like but. But I, he wanted you he to fight your dad, it, didn't yeah. he? Yeah, I wasn't yeah. going to pull out, but. Obviously, people around me was like, you don't have to do this fight if you don't want to do it, but I did. Mm -hmm. Right, well, hopefully, your, your dad's going to get better. Yeah. Uh, and when are we going to see you out next? Do you know? September, I think. On the 15th, then? He's at yeah, the Tory Warehouse? Yeah, he's having a good rest now. He's going on holiday again. And um, <laughs> he'll come back and then we'll have a look at things then. Yeah, but yeah. hey, listen, this is, what was that, fight number 14, inside two years. Guy's got to be the busiest prospect out there, and uh, and he's doing pretty well. Yeah, yeah. You good. can't be too too hard on him, can you, Tommy? Yeah, I can. <laughs> no I'm going happy. How can I be happy with that? Getting hit with that right hand, and um, we've been working and working on it. You know, so no, I'm not happy, and, but we'll sort all that out when we get back. <laughs> Listen, congratulations, lads! It's been a fantastic night, and rounded off with a fantastic fight. Yeah, I'd just like to say thank you to uh, Tommy and uh, Mo who've been here tonight for me. Um, Ian couldn't make it, um, I don't, yeah, I'm not too sure we were busy anyway. Um, and I'd like to say thank you to all my sponsors. Two now. Got them on your back, haven't One you? One of you, and then the rest are on my back. Little Eva's meat cleaver. And I can't Able Facility either. Solutions Limited, Hannon uh, uh, Avard Accountancy, Hannon Holmes, who's a big sponsor, Love Food, Gaz is always at the gym with us, Heritage Health Care, Phantom Motor Company, the new in pub, which he's he's always in, he loves that place. <laughs> and um, what's it? Same day Hauliers, GMBT Logistics Services, and his new one, turn around, PSG scaffolding. So is that, is that who you should work for? Like, is that? No, 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 no. no.
Rowcrest scaffolding Rowcrest needs work for. Yeah. I don't know, well listen, congratulations, fantastic performance. What's that, 13 and 1 now? Yeah, yeah. 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 Well yeah. done, lads. Nice one with 14 and 1, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, nice one. Bye.